Welcome to the Learning Academy. Today we'll be discussing mathematics. Mathematics is a lot of fun. It is a part of our everyday lives and it is the foundation for many of the items that we use today. Now, remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. We love having you here at the Learning Academy. Now, today let us discuss fractions. Fractions are fun. Fractions represent equal parts of a whole. A fraction will show you the number of parts of a whole that you have. Right? So if you were to divide an item into equal parts, then each part of that item is a fraction. Now, there are different types of fractions. We have mixed fractions. Mixed fractions, equivalent fractions, unit fractions, improper fractions, and proper fractions. Fractions also have three parts. The three parts of a fraction are the numerator, the denominator, the fractional bar, or the viniculum. We all know that the numerator is the number that is at the top of the fraction. This is the number that is above the fractional bar. There is also the denominator. This denominator is below the fractional bar. The viniculum is the line that separates the denominator from the numerator. Now let us discuss the different types of fractions. There is the proper fraction. A proper fraction shows the amount of parts that you have. You have. Proper fractions are fractions in which the numerator is less than the denominator. Examples include 3 quarters, 2 thirds, or 5 over 10. There is also unit fractions. These fractions are fractions in which the numerator is 1. Example, 1 over 2, 1 over 3, 1 over 5, 1 over 6, and the list goes on. There are also improper fractions. These fractions are fractions in which the numerator is greater than or equals the denominator. So this includes 10 over 9. This also includes 11 over 10. Then we have mixed fractions. These fractions consist of a whole number along with a proper fraction. Thank you for being here today. 